Hi, it's uh, Glenn Dietzel here, live from the Canadian Lake Home. And I just want to let you know that I'm traveling during our normal Google Hangout time. Today I'm away with my family, with my boys, my wife's in Scotland. So I wanted to let you uh, have access to one of our best Google Hangouts that we've done recently. So enjoy it and I look forward to doing another live Google Hangout with you next week, normal time. Hello everybody and welcome to uh, another episode of our Business Breakthrough Google Hangouts. It's Glenn Dietzel here live from our international office and if you haven't had a chance yet to uh, get our uh, Lifestyle Entrepreneur Magazine. You can get it on the iPad and i on your iPad and iPhone. It's only available for those markets so far. We have our April issue coming out uh, next week, uh, and I'm really excited about it. Um, actually, it's going to be uh, published. Uh, well, it's already published. We're just waiting for iTunes to uh, to set have that all set up for our second issue. So, really excited about that, and um, a lot of really cool. Uh, articles and uh, feature stories and profiles that we're covering in uh, Lifestyle Entrepreneur magazine. So just wanted to quickly uh, shout out for our magazine. I've been away um, all last week. was working in Vegas for a one-day intensive and those of you that were there uh, and our paths crossed for the very first time. It was really nice to meet you. And uh, for our Omega Mind members, we had our uh, three-day event afterwards and so I did four back-to-back -back days. They were very long days uh, from morning till uh, late at night, uh, assisting my clients on bottom line closing deals, putting and structuring their value, uh, how to put their programs together. Um, our Omega Mind members learned from case studies within our Omega Mind group, people that have been doing just like I've been telling them to do and closing their uh, first high-end deals their first events, etc. So uh, very excited and I'll be sharing a lot of those photos with you and uh, videos with you uh, over the next uh, several weeks. Um, I've been very ill since I got back from Vegas. Um, don't worry, it's not, communic it's not communicable uh, through our Google Hangout here, at least I don't think so. Uh, but I wanted to, uh, I'm just very excited and very pumped about what my clients have been able to do. So I wanted to share with you today a very cool uh, way of, of looking at masterminds. Um, it's not something that I talk about a lot. However, it's a really, really uh, powerful model that my clients are all leveraging and uh, that I'm teaching in Omega Mind on how to leverage the power of uh, of mastermind. So I'm going to clear here today and just uh, be up front here with you. So I cleared on my lower screen here because I'm going to uh, show and talk to you today about the power of a mastermind. And I'm going to take you through a few things that we do and what I advocate for you uh, in developing your own mastermind group. Uh, if you look at what Omega Mind is, it's our version of a mastermind group. And when I put Omega Mind together, my version of a mastermind group, what I didn't want it to do was to become another sit and get. Another sit and get where people, and I've paid a lot of money, twenty-five to $50,000 for a number of mastermind groups where you get a lot of really good information, but at the end of the day, you leave and you've got no way of, of executing. So... I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do something uh, a lot different. Um, and uh, we've put together a, uh, I put together here a, a few questions here that I'm going to address with you and share with you what, from my uh, best practices, what I would recommend for you uh, in the area of mastermind. And of course, when it comes to mastermind, you know, the everybody thinks of the Napoleon Hill Foundation and uh, Napoleon Hill's Think and Grow Rich, right? And his whole concept behind that was to bring a group of like-minded people together and help them uh, grow. The whole group grows together and it can grow faster than the sum of its individual parts. And the problem that I see with mastermind groups today is that Back when masterminds were first formulated, there wasn't the internet. There wasn't the onslaught of information and advice. Um, there wasn't so many ways to get derailed. 
um, with through lack of focus and the inability to execute. And two of the greatest paralyzers that I see in the marketplace today with entrepreneurs, and I see this all over the world, is number one, their inability to focus. Um, I think that's the, a bigger problem and a bigger reality than I've ever seen having been doing um, and, and teaching clients how to command high prices for their programs and services and building out um, royalty revenues with that and doing that for the last 12 years I can honestly say I've never seen entrepreneurs business owners startups more uh, more unfocused and more um, more hesitant in taking the critical next step that they must take in their business uh, to not just survive but to thrive in today's economy so um, when I decided to put our Omega Mind program together, which is my own customized version of a mastermind, which is away from a sit and get, which is really focused on execution and focus, and um, and teaching all the members on that are part of my Omega Mind group on how to execute, um, it, it's brought me unbelievable, unparalleled results. Um, coming out of the teaching field, one of the things that I've realized is that um, my competitive advantage and one of the reasons why people hire my company out is because I am a former educator and the skill sets of making it in business and the skill sets of teaching somebody to be successful are completely separate so um, I'm going to lay for you the foundation of what I've um, put together um, some of the fundamentals on creating your own mastermind group successfully and why you should have it and uh, a few ways of thinking through this I'm also going to share with you uh, a few uh, pictures um, at the end of uh, some recent uh, what I've been doing just recently here I don't have a ton of pictures whoops let me uh, get out of that here for a second here uh, just because uh, as I said I've just literally got back from Vegas and uh, I wanted to uh, share uh, this with you. So let's move forward here together. And uh, there's a number of comments that have been coming in uh, about getting our Lifestyle Entrepreneur Magazine. So make sure you just use the URL. It's a short uh, URL uh, that goes to our iTunes. Um, our iTunes. It'll go to an, uh, an iTunes link so you can uh, get the app for uh, our digital magazine that's budurl.com forward slash l-e-m-a-g okay so to answer any questions about that so let's move forward today the first question is why have a mastermind why have a mastermind okay <coughs> pretty good question uh, actually an excellent question I always start with a why um, why have a mastermind one of the reasons why you should always start with a why question too when you're teaching and helping you know facilitate uh, training events or working with your own clients is because the why learners are the, are the least patient learner so starting with the why question why have a, a, a mastermind is a pretty sensible question and I want to share with you right now that one of the reasons why uh, most gurus today seem to have uh, mastermind groups is that there's huge profit margins that run 95% and higher huge profit margins that run 95% and higher now I want to uh, when I said about most gurus have a mastermind today most gurus have what I call a sit and get you know they create a mastermind and they do it because it creates a, a lot of money for them as I said with profit margins that run 95% and higher however the problem with masterminds today and I can tell you that firsthand being involved in them and also having clients that are part of other uh, programs that come into our program um, the biggest problem as I said is their inability to execute uh, all this great information but at the end of the day no ability to execute so why have a mastermind group first of all definitely whatever is allowing you to create or will allow you to create high profit margins especially around premium price programs and services as opposed to you know going into a marketplace <coughs> with a low-end 
product and wasting all of your time there. You want to have high profit margins. That's crucial. All right. Secondly, if you're going to put a mastermind together today, and why have one? It's the perfect way of modeling best practices. The perfect way. <coughs> excuse me, of modeling best practices. Mastermind groups uh, and the way that I've put together our Omega Mind group allows me to model what, I've, what I do in business, what I advocate with other clients, what I advocate with my own one-on-one -on -one clients. And it allows people in a group setting to be able to not only learn from me, but to be able to get the kind of support that they need in terms of execution and even more importantly, watching what other Omega Mind members do so that they can learn from them. I've created a very intimate, um, high trust group. Uh, in fact, I just sent a message to all of our Omega Mind members at the end of last week about how I just absolutely um, can't believe the intimacy and the trust that we've all developed and are developing uh, because of uh, because of the level of person that I've been able to attract into my mastermind group, so um, into our Omega Mind group. So I want to stress to you the fact that modeling is the number one way that we learn, and if modeling is the number one way that we learn, that everything that you do with your in your mastermind group should be focused on modeling. And if you are a, if you understand the importance of teaching and training in today's marketplace, you're definitely going to want to leverage the power of your own mastermind. Third, third reason why you should have your own mastermind group is it's better than your own board of advisors. It's better than your own board of advisors. Um, there's something very powerful when you're in front of your group and you're teaching and not only as all of my clients will tell me and have told me, that they learn even more and faster when they do the teaching. And uh, that's why in the science of how people learn and the science of accelerated learning, you can accelerate your own learning and teaching. You can accelerate your own client's results if you have a better model of teaching and of learning. And that's one of the reasons why our Omega Mind group has been, I think, so powerful is it combines the best of business acceleration and the best of uh, accelerated teaching and learning. So having uh, uh, it's better, as I said, than a board of advisors. You're getting your own clients to give you feedback. You're getting your own clients the kind of results that they want. You're listening to your clients talk about what it is that you've done for them. That kind of feedback what I, which, I, which I call marketing feedback data, that kind of data is, is more valuable than any data that an advisor, that an expert will teach you. Getting real life feedback, marketing feedback from your own clients. And so why have a mastermind? Well, if you understand the importance of modeling and you understand the importance of modeling um, what it is that you want to teach your target market so they get their results that they want, their ta your target market, uh, i.e. your own members within your own mastermind group. Hearing them talk about what it is that you do and hearing them express what it is that you've done for them in their own words will give you the kind of data, the kind of language, and how to position yourself in the marketplace further. And so one of the ways that we built, uh, we've continued to build and have built our competitive advantage in the market is through marketing feedback data. <coughs> and I'm all about speed to market, right? My clients know me as uh, Mr. Results or <laughs> speed to market results. And uh, <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to just have to slip out here and grab a bottle of water. One second, please. <coughs> I should have brought um, water with me from my other desk. This is our video uh, studio right here in our international office. And uh, if you've just joined us here, I'm fighting uh, a bit of a 
uh, a cold, a uh, bad cold that's been hanging around now for six days. Um, and uh, so it makes uh, that little tickle in your throat sometimes I uh, can get to you. So I wanted to just stress to you the importance of, first of all, why have a mastermind group? Next, I want to take a look at how to command top fees and royalties from your mastermind groups. How to command top fees and royalties from them. My first rule is this. In creating a mastermind group today to set yourself apart from anybody else is to make sure that you get away from the sit and get model. Get away from the sit and get model. This is not the marketplace to just give people information. Um, I can't stress that enough. That was the information age. This is the advisory age. People want help in triaging their problems, assessing their problems, just like the medical profession does, right? They want assistance on execution. They want ROI. And more importantly, your clients want ROIT, return on invested time. So when they spend a unit of time, it's going to reproduce for them multiple units of time back to them. That's the power of of royalties. So first concept, our principle around how to command top fees and royalties from your mastermind group is do not create a sit and get. If it's just a sit and get, it's not going to allow you the leverage that you're really looking for. Secondly, focus on results. Focus on results. Whoops. Focus on results. Any program that I've put together, whether it's one-on-one -on -one consulting, whether I'm flying in to work with a company, uh, whether clients are coming in and investing their time and money to work with me through a one-day intensive at the Canadian Lake Home, um, or whether I'm doing uh, Omega Mind events, it doesn't matter what it is. Everything that I focus on with clients is focused on ROI, return on investment. And if you create your own mastermind group that's focused on ROI, and most importantly, ROIT, you're going to have, you're going to be able to set up for yourself and command much higher fees and be able to leverage the power of creating royalties from your mastermind group. Next principle here that we teach, use and leverage an executive summary. Use and leverage an executive summary. The power of an executive summary um, really allows, has really allowed me to speed up the conversion process. You know that we're all about flipping the business funnel, right? Um, positioning high-end programs and services, how to command high-end fees and attract premium priced clients. One of the keys that we teach all of our clients is to use the power of an executive summary. The executive summary if that allows you to not have to have a website if you don't have to or don't want to you it doesn't allow it, it required it doesn't it, it it prevents you or that's not the word I'm trying to say um, I think the cold is a little bit stuffy in my head here um, you don't have to worry about having uh, a presentation you don't have to worry about having a sales proposal you don't have to worry about all these tools and and tactics that people create to close deals. What you need is to have a few strategically created assets um, with your company so that it allows you to facilitate and allows you to um, ex, um, accelerate conversations in the marketplace. So make sure that you leverage the power of an executive summary. Um, on a previous Google Hangout, I've gone through the principles that go be, are, are involved in a really good executive summary, um, and uh, we're really uh, good, I have to say, at helping our clients create executive summaries uh, that close deals. Here's a really important point um, in commanding higher fees and uh, setting the stage for creating royalties with your mastermind. Bring together an industry or key players from different market segments together. Bring together an industry or key players from different market segments together. Um, that's really powerful. You can do this in your own marketplace, in your own home market, 
uh, local market, build some massive traction for what you're doing or who you are, just by bringing, uh, uh, picking out some key players um, in different niche markets or niche markets and organizing a group uh, for them. Um, you can also bring in an industry um, and you can organize a mastermind group um, within an industry. <coughs> what I'm sharing with you right now is some ways to command higher fees because you're bringing people that want to be part of a bigger game. That's crucial. All right, People want to be part of something bigger than themselves. So you want to make sure in order to command higher fees that you're, you're, they're feeling the sense that this is something bigger. This is something better. And when I say bigger or better, um, uh, one of the rules that uh, um, uh, Steve Jobs had set up with Apple is, or one of his principles was, it doesn't have to be better, it just has to be different. Um, I'm telling you in today's market, to set up your mastermind group today, you want to definitely be different than anybody else, and you can be a lot better than any other mastermind group by following these principles. The most important one then is once you have your cert your your program set up, create a certification and a co-branding uh, arrangement with the people who are in your mastermind group. So why not certify them in your methods of doing your own mastermind group and creating your own, if you will, certified trainers that can work uh, with other groups uh, or other organizations that maybe aren't as profitable for you, but they're profitable to those people and they'd be willing to do them, your certified trainers, and setting up a co-branding relationship that would allow you to uh, receive royalty revenue on an ongoing basis because of uh, their your involvement or, or leveraging your authority and your credibility, your systems, the way that you do things with your own certified trainers. So for them to be able to have ongoing assistance, they would pay you a royalty and they would also pay you a royalty if they ever used your systems with their clients. So you can create these kind of systems within your own mastermind group and then you can create certified trainers of your own mastermind group that go into other markets or other uh, areas within your uh, community or your own uh, city or region. They run the mastermind and they're leveraging some of your systems and paying you a royalty for the use of those systems. Highly, highly, highly strategic. And as, I, as I've said over the last several months, um, nobody is doing this that I know of in today's marketplace. So it's really going to give you a huge competitive advantage. And a special note on co-branding, we're not talking about licensing because as soon as you affix any kind of service around a license, you're really a franchise. And it's not franchising. Um, and I'm not a fan of franchising, especially with coaching, consulting, and training. Why? Because I haven't seen a model that really works. Uh, most of them fail, and the only people that really make any money are the franchisors, not the franchisees. And for a whole number of reasons that I've covered in the you know, on previous trainings, why I'm not an advocate of franchising, um, your advice following that model um, using a, a coaching, consulting, or training model uh, business model. So I'm a huge advocate of coaching and co-branding where in order to really build royalties you want to leverage the power of certification and having a mastermind group of putting that together great way to leverage uh, certification and, uh, and co-branding. Next question then is how to fill your mastermind? How to fill your mastermind? It's a really good question. Um, the best way that I have found to fill my mastermind, and uh, we teach a number of different systems, but because of time today, I'm going to cover uh, the best way that we've been able to, and that my clients have been able to fill their own uh, mastermind and high-end groups, is the luxury home model. The luxury home model. Today, it's crucial that you have a lure. Um, I might not sound like I have a lure today because my nose is a little bit stuffy and I'm still a little bit under the weather, uh, but 
uh, you have to have allure. There's got to be something different about you. Remember I said you don't have to be better, you just have to be different. And having a luxury home and bringing people into your home is a really powerful way. Um, I'm not one, you know, I could spend hours showing you all of our luxury homes and what we do. And that comes off, for me, not the way that I want. I'd rather you see my wife, uh, my kids who are at uh, the Canadian Lake Home. We bring people here. We were just at the Vegas Sand Castle in Las Vegas. And I'd rather, you know, show you how that, um, and what I'm really proud of is 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 how bringing people into my own place, one of our places, we, uh, for example, the uh, the Canadian Lake Home, well, that's uh, allowed my kids to learn from me and learn from my clients, and just opening up our our uh, the Canadian Lake Home with my family there, it's been one of the best things that I've ever done in business. So uh, there's five. I want to just give you five rules on getting your own luxury home. Because it's just so powerful, so effective. You don't have to own your own home at the beginning. Um, one of the things that I did three years ago when I ran my very first high-end uh, intensive, small um, uh, intensives, I don't do seminars, uh, I don't do um, conferences, I do intensives. And I wanted a business intensives or business acceleration intensives. When I started this model three years ago, I would take, uh, I rented a, a luxury home, a huge mansion, uh, 40,000 square feet, 10 bedrooms in it. And I invited, and uh, well, I invited, eight people went through our application process. And based on that, they were invited to attend and they got a ticket. They attended uh, my um my intensive that I did, and I realized how powerful that was. So we started to do them in Canada because I thought, well, people really want to come to Canada, and that's why I decided to start in Florida. And uh, the properties that we had at that time really did fit what I wanted in the U.S. Uh, we've got properties in different places in, in America, but um, opening it or starting our own, my own one-day intensives. Um, at the Canadian Lake Home and then bringing our Omega Mind members to here is one of the absolute best things that I've ever done. So getting your own luxury home and leveraging it um, is for me a dream come true. And I want to give you five principles to help you think through that for yourself. First of all, always use experts to get your dream home. Um, we got uh, every deal, uh, every every home that we've ever purchased, we've always had a deal, got a deal on the home. Why? because we've leveraged experts. Secondly, using your dream home, create a business model which allows you to cash flow your asset. Create a business model which allows you to cash flow your asset. There's nothing faster than cash flowing your assets, especially your home, if you use it for a mastermind. Three, create a lure, all right? Create a lure with your home, all right? So uh, that's really important is to create a lure for brand it. We call ours the Canadian Lake Home, for example, or the Vegas Sandcastle. Um, and there's other places um, that we've branded. Uh, fifth, celebrate it with others. Celebrate it with others. All right. When we first uh, uh, um, got uh, the Canadian Lake Home, we celebrated uh, locally uh, in our own estate with people that live by, brought them in, and uh, I did a one-day intensive uh, immediately um, to celebrate uh, the new place and to bring people in uh, to learn directly from me. So those are five uh, principles on getting your own dream home, and I uh, can't uh, stress to you enough, if you want to really leverage um, the mastermind model that we teach, which we call our mastermind monetizer model, having your own luxury home or you know, having that as a goal um, in our program is absolutely, uh, I believe it's, it, it'll really help make things a lot easier for you. The next question and our last question is why uh, you don't have to be an expert and how to get uh, the best people in your mastermind. Why you don't have to be an expert and how to get the best people in your mastermind. Um, clients come to us usually under one of two scenarios and, and, and now more than ever a third scenario. The first scenario that people why they come to our company is they 
and they choose our, our company <coughs> is because they don't want to be an expert or they sorry they do want to be an expert but they don't want to write a book or they don't want to do all the other cost and time consuming activities second reason why people come uh, to uh, us and, and and invest in our programs and services is they're tired of spending so much time effort and money attracting low end clients you know trading 200 their time for money $200 an hour um, or spending all their time promoting a low end book or product when they really want to invert the funnel, business funnel, and really command uh, high end uh, prices for their programs and services. And the third reason um, that people come and invest in our programs is they don't want to be an expert, but they love how, um, how we teach our clients how to put their own mastermind groups together. And so you can attract top tier people by first of all making it a principle in your business that you're only going to attract like-minded people for your uh, for your mastermind like-minded people you know it's very interesting that as you grow and you begin to attract the kind of client that you really want and asking for referrals and they'll and you, you realize that by asking for referrals people will refer and here's the secret around referrals people will refer people who are as as good as if not better than them okay that's the law of referrals people will refer people that are as least as good at as and usually better than them themselves why because it's sort of like the law of reciprocity you do something and you're a huge value to somebody people feel like you know what I want to do something back for 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 you and what I have seen in referrals is that people you know they want to do they do to they do th things for two reasons they'll they'll promote you or recommend you for make because they want to make money and more importantly they'll refer you or promote you because they want to look good to you and because they want to look good to you they want to promote or recommend the best people that they know and so the law of referral is really powerful uh, in terms of growing and attracting uh, the kinds of people that you really want to so make sure that you have a, a referral program and secondly and make sure though with that referral program that you're really clear on your vetting process your vetting process we've covered that on previous Google Hangouts is really tied to your executive summary and so people know how how you're vetting them for your program the other concept that I want to point out is to make sure that um, and this is a really powerful one have access to tier one and two, tier two business political and entertainment celebrities access or have access to tier one and tier two business political and entertainment celebrities this is really powerful from the standpoint that you can raise um, the level of momentum of your mastermind group by in, by inviting top tier people into your mastermind group and those top people are as I said really should come from three tiers and depends on your marketplace they could be business people they could be entertainment people and they could be people that come out of the political arena or it could be a combination of that so if you follow what I just shared with you around filling and why you should have a mastermind group how to command top fees for your mastermind group and royalties how to some strategies on how to fill your mastermind group and how to attract the right kinds of people into your mastermind group with just these simple uh, systems that I've shared with you today create so you can create for yourself some serious uh, leveraged momentum I'm going to just share with you here uh, three pictures um, this here is some of the properties that uh, clients so when they invest in Omega mind have access to um, here is one of my recent uh, one-day intensives right here at the Vegas Sandcastle and uh, this is the Canadian Lake home where we do uh, I do some of my Omega my our groups here depends on the time of the year we'll be doing uh, our summer and our fall events here and uh, there's the sunset 
outside of Lake Huron, uh, um, uh, outside of the Canadian Lake Home, and as I've shared on uh, many Google Hangouts when I share with you uh, sunsets or what's happening on the lake outside of the Canadian Lake Home, we have been rated uh, by um, on the National Geographic, our area, right off the Canadian Lake Home, the beaches of the Canadian Lake Home, uh, which is Lake Huron, uh, is one of the top three uh, sunset areas, or to view the areas to view the sunsets in the world. So it's pretty exciting, and I just I thought I would share that with you. Um, that's uh, all that I have I'm going to be speaking on today around uh, um, creating a mastermind group and selling them for top dollar, $25,000 to $50,000 and higher. Please take the concepts that I covered today um, uh, and implement them in your own business. Um, I want you to just challenge all of you to become a lot more strategic in how you think and how you execute uh, because that means all the difference in today's marketplace. It's all about speed, speed to market, speed to market speed to market. So I look forward to our next uh, Business Breakthrough Google Hangout together. Uh, if I can be of further assistance to you, uh, don't hesitate to phone our international office at 519-542-3043, 519-542-3043. It's the same number that my clients phone and uh, I look forward to our, our paths crossing again on our next Google Hangout. Have a great one everyone.